Hi, my name is Guillaume Butin. I'm in charge of uh, marketing at Prophecy. Uh, Prophecy is the inventor of the world's most advanced neuromorphic vision systems, essentially a sensor that mimics the way the human eye acquires and handles the visual information, and AI algorithms that mimic the way the brain deals with that kind of information. Uh, both of these together because we want to emulate the way us humans handle visual information. So we mostly focus on movement. Uh, we make sense of the scene by focusing on what moves meaning that we're able to filter out the rest, which is static, which doesn't really matter to us. So the brain is never overloaded with useless data. So what we do is that we acquire useful information more than raw data. This is what we are demonstrating here. So this is our third generation sensor, which is currently filming myself. If I stop moving completely, I will get down to zero kilo events per second, which is the figure you can see on the top left hand corner. As soon as I start moving, I trigger what we call events. An event is essentially one pixel in the sensor which, act, which activates itself depending on the amount of light it receives. So this is very different from traditional frame-based sensors or vision sensors as a whole uh, because there is no frame rate. Uh, each pixel make, uh, makes an informed decision uh, about activating itself or not depending, of the, depending on the move it sees, the contrast detection it sees in the scene. So in a sense, we don't generate raw data. What we do generate though is useful information, which is much smaller in size than uh, what a frame would be. So uh, as, as a general rule, we would be at around 10 to 1,000 times less data uh, generate, generative than uh, traditional sensors, uh, because we focus on what moves. We see things extremely fast. Uh, if you had to do an equivalent between us and a frame-based sensor, it would be at around 10K FPS, which would be the maximum limit of the sensor. So we can see things, see things that happen at extremely fast rates. Uh, we generate less data, so we need less power to operate. Uh, we operate at around 10 milliwatts at the sensor level. And also, because each pixel is independent in the, in the sensor, uh, they will be able to adjust their exposure individually. So we have an extremely wide dynamic range, uh, which is at around 120 decibels. If you'd like some more information, you can visit prophecy.ai.